new pure ev e3 350 so 350 is like a model variant so 350 means it's a 3.5 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery range so that is the 350 meaning of the battery range 3.5 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery so this is the new vehicle from pure ev from electric vehicle so so in this bike the complete design is very sleek design when we when we get a sleek design the bike will get a more aerodynamic in this bike except indicators completely headlamps and tail lamps are really complete led headlamps as well as led tail lamp except indicators indicators are the halogen indicators it is 7 inch display with speedometer odometer and tachometer with battery range completely all with a digital instrumentation 7 inch digital instrumentation this is a perfect visibility in an city driving as well as driving performance i will tell you in driving range it gets a very sleek design of side vendors with a e-trish badging and a led drls it gets a 6 hours of slow charging in the company there is no fast charging it is in a testing and consideration apply in this bike this bike gets a 18 inch alloy wheels with a tubeless tires with 240 mm of disc brake with calipers of pure company so this is the tires perfect tires for a good ride for 3.5 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery with a charging range of 85 km is the top speed and 140 km range is the fuel mileage battery range this seating is a softer seating for a older person this is very good and very ride quality very good ride quality in this bike of this seating comfort 18 inch tubeless tires rare tires with a good ride quality with a multi spoke wheel system this vehicle gets a 3 kilowatt nominal motor to 4 kilowatt peak motor this is a very high torque in this vehicle the minimum torque is there there are three driving modes. there are three driving modes in this motorcycle three driving modes gets a 3 newton meter of torque variation so first driving mode it gets a 16 newton meter of torque in second driving mode 120 newton meter of torque in a third driving mode 175 newton meter of torque when we apply the throttle when we apply the driving modes and when we change the driving mode the torque variation is applied in the motor in this bike front suspension and rear suspension is a hydraulic suspension for a good ride quality for and and the rear suspension is a adjustable hydraulic suspension i will tell you in the driving performance how is the suspension is working for this bike